Religious life is coming together as a community, either you're with your brothers or with your sisters. Um, something that makes me happy <laughs> gives me meaning to my life. I felt this real pull and I thought, you know, black people don't become sisters. You know, this, you know, I'm too, I like boys, I don't need to become a sister. So I was driving up Fell Street in San Francisco from work one day and this car was in front of me and there was a bumper sticker on it and it said, don't die wondering. The vows for me are a way of life. I would describe the vows as challenging. <laughs> as guidelines. The biggest challenge for me in religious life is what people, other people, may think and expect religious life should look like. We can't live our life without prayer. It's like, it's like um, just without water. <laughs> I knew I wasn't holy, that's for sure. I didn't want to have kids and a husband. Right before I entered, I, I went through a vocational crisis. So here I was becoming a candidate, but then here I am finally meeting this person. Now is the time to Those who are interested in religious life, keep your eyes on Jesus.